Hi, my name is Nikki and welcome to Your Town Draw 497 Berry Prize Home. This wonderful prize not only includes this gorgeous cottage and all its contents, but also 350k gold bullion. What more could you wish for? I'm a Berry local and due to the COVID-19 restrictions, I've been asked to take you on the tour of this wonderful home. So, come right in. Let's go in this quaint country gate the pathway, past this beautiful garden, lots of white iceberg roses, more of the garden later, onto the veranda, very deep veranda. Welcome to Glen Rose Cottage. Let's take a look inside. Lovely front door with a stained glass feature. Come right in. We have ironbark timber flooring, it's solid timber, a security system, antique brass hardware on all the doors. And let's take a look in the master bedroom firstly. It's just off the central hallway. This is a lovely heritage style cottage, but with the advantage of being very recently built. Take a look inside. Wonderful new furniture. Imagine spending the night in this four poster bed. It's just beautiful. Lovely high ceilings, plaster cornices, high skirting boards. It's everything you could ever wish for. Period style light fittings. Let's go and take a look inside the ensuite. Porcelain floor tiles. Lovely. Pressed metal style porcelain wall tiles in the shower recess, all fitted out in beautiful heritage style. Okay, we'll go and take a look in the walk in row. Just one moment, and I'll just shut the front door. into the master bedroom and let's have a look in the walk-in room. Wow, so much storage. Look at that. This is easy living. Single level, low maintenance. If you've ever dreamt of escaping the rat race and having a tree or a sea change, you've come to the right place in Berry. We're located only 10 to 15 minutes to the beach. I forgot to mention that earlier on. Let's have a look in the second bedroom. Beautiful cast iron bed. Look at this. Built-in wardrobes. Lots of storage there. French doors out onto the veranda. The veranda surrounds this section of the house. We have linen look curtains, sheer curtains and also roll blinds. This room's just stunning too. Okay, back into the entrance foyer. Heritage style timber fretwork here. We have the linen cupboard, very big linen cupboard. Again, lots of storage. Solid timber doors throughout. Wide hallway, just like the good old days. Now we come down here to the main bathroom. Oh, we have a gorgeous cast iron bath. It's a real antique bath, fully restored by Antique Baths Australia. Again, same floor tiles as the ensuite. French pattern, just stunning. Have a little look around. Let's go back through to the hallway. A gorgeous antique hall stand. Okay, into the third bedroom. Come and take a look in here. A lovely cast iron bed again. So beautiful. More storage. French doors that also lead out into the veranda. 
will come out to the veranda a bit later on. And I'll take you on the tour of that. This room has a desk, an Apple laptop, lots of inclusions in this house. Okay, now we'll go through to the laundry. Wow, we've got brand new fish and paper washing machine and dryer. Press mill on the walls. Lots of storage again. A third toilet in here. And a door to outside where the clothesline is located. We'll just take a quick look at this now. The clothesline's outside, out here. And then we have the gas bottles for gas hot water. Herb garden out here. Very easy living. Come straight out the laundry and hang your washing on the line. Okay. Also, another feature is we have pull-out clotheslines up the top in both cupboards. Very handy. Okay. Come back through. Down the hallway. This house has soundproofing throughout, although it is a, actually a very quiet area. It's just so if somebody's in one bedroom and you might be watching TV in the other, uh, you don't hear the noise from the TV. And we'll just come back down the hallway and show there is a door here. So you can close off the bedrooms from the rest of the house. We have ducted air conditioning here, Dakin. That goes throughout the whole home. Okay, we're in the hallway again, and now into this gorgeous living room. Look at this. Very high ceilings again. A wood combustion fireplace for those cold winter evenings. Imagine snuggling up in front of the fire. That's just beautiful. Another TV here. Custom built, built in bookcases. Lots of storage. If you've got a big book collection, you can put them here. Just lovely. Okay, this room is quite large. It has a door on each side that leads out to the verandas. Casement style windows, very easy to open. Antique brass hardware. I must mention that all the windows have sheer curtains, linen style, with block out blinds behind. Lovely seat in the window. The door leads out to the veranda. Oh, it's just beautiful out there. We will go and have a better look at the garden later, but as you can see, it's just lovely. Okay, another door out to the veranda here as well. Okay, we'll come back to that later. All right. Double doors to the lounge room if you do want to close it off. Now let's go across to the second living room, the media room. Or if you did require a fourth bedroom, you could use it for that, but it's been set up as a beautiful media room. Wow, so relaxing just sitting here. Included in the home with a big TV. Everything that you can see is included. It's a fantastic prize. Just beautiful. Okay. Solid timber flooring throughout the entire home. Very easy living. Single level. Wow, let's take a look at the kitchen. Here we go. We have a hand-painted solid timber kitchen. Country style. Big pantry. Well, oh, everything you need just to move straight in if you win this prize. It's fantastic. We come across the oven. It's a belly range cooker. Induction cooktop, super fast. Electric oven. Look at everything you could fit in there. 
Just fantastic. That's a very tall oven there. Another one down the bottom and up the top, as well as a grill. Got all your pots and pans that you need. Knives, everything. Fantastic new fridge. LG fridge, more storage up the top. Fantastic. Come across here, we've got all the appliances. Pots and pans. Bin cupboard. Fire clay sink. Perishy style tapware. Drawers. Lots of cupboards, a deep drawer. The cake tins. Microwave. Cutlery drawer. Fully concealed dishwasher there, Miele. More storage, brand new Nespresso, Nespresso coffee machine. Another lovely lead light window, porthole. Looking back down the hallway, you can have a look at that beautiful heritage style hallway. And this dining table, beautiful dining area. Imagine entertaining here. Heritage style light fittings. It's just lovely. Let's take a look outside. We'll go through the French doors. As you can see here, that leads to the lounge room. So you've got another door straight back into the living area if you're entertaining. Down the back stairs this beautiful paved courtyard area. Lots more roses. Wicker outdoor setting. Oh, and look at this. A chook shed. To put your own chooks in. Just lovely. Absolutely lovely. Well, here's the garage. We'll just take a look at that later. We'll have a look out the front at the garden. Lots of white iceberg roses, lavender, and also established fruit trees. We have apple trees, lemon, lime, lemonade, plum, grapefruit. Look at this, it's just laden with fruit. It's just beautiful. Lush green grass. These are all fruit trees. And onto the veggie garden. Verandas around the house. Through this beautiful archway. Out the front. Here's some of the fruit trees again. Lovely orange. Just take a shot of the house from the outside and then we'll go back through to the garage. It's a lovely architect design.
eight leads down here, all fully paved, herb garden here, air conditioning there. Here's your clothesline, very handy to the laundry. And back out to the backyard. All right. Right into the garage. Now this garage could be used uh, either for your car, obviously, or perhaps you might like to use it for a studio. It's all jib -propped. It's a double length garage, remote roller door. You can see how it connects to the courtyard and across to the house. It's lovely having it separate, especially if somebody wants it as a, you know, a hobby room. Just fantastic. Okay, down the driveway. Lovely quiet area. Only two minutes drive into town. Or you can also walk. There's a footpath that links this entire area straight into the village. And it probably takes 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, we'll walk around the side. quiet it is here. Looking back towards the house. Beautiful country garden. Looking up to the lush green rolling hills of Berry. much for taking a look at the Berry Prize home and best of luck, best of luck in the draw. Thank you from Nicola at your town.